Hi. Um, just looking for us. And there I am. Look at that. As if by magic. Am I the right way around? Because it wouldn't let us go live on a wonk. No, we're not. We're sideways. I'm sorry. Um, I don't know why it wouldn't let us go live until I turned it around the right way. I thought it might... Um, changed its mind once I turned the star thing on. Oh. Obviously not. Sorry, I'm just looking for the live. Um, if you're here, would you invite or share the live because I have a feeling that Facebook is just being awkward. Um, right. Okay, so hello Maureen. Hello, hello, hello. Right, I don't know what's wrong with Facebook, but it wouldn't let us go the right way around. So that's frustrating. And then it's not letting us share the live. So anybody that's here, if you would share the live, I would love you forever and ever. And ever and ever and ever. That would be fabulous. But I don't know what's wrong with it. We're sideways and everything. It wouldn't let us click live. And I thought because it was the, the star thing was turned off. But who knows? Seriously, who knows? Technology, yeah? Hi, Sheila. Hi, Tracy. Hi, Andrew. Hi, de hi. So, we're going back to the junk journal that was started on YouTube on Sunday. Now, I have done a zippy thing, and I have done another zippy thing in here, but you're going to have to pretend that you haven't seen it because it's what's coming out this weekend. And the stuff has arrived, so I'm thinking I'll just put it on the website on Friday. And then so be it. So this is one of the zip things. It's a pocket. It's paper. This is um, kit two. Emma's happy face. Kit two. Flowertastic. And basically it's a zip. It's a pocket. Um, you can attach the paper to fabric to make it even more sturdy. You can even sew with it. If you haven't got a sewing machine, then don't. Just glue it. You can do it loads of different ways. I will show you this one, but you're going to have to pretend you haven't seen it. Because I'm not supposed to be doing peaks yet. But this is... Oh, hang on. I've got all, all the bits inside. I'm going to take them out so you can't see everything. Uh, <laughs> well, there we go. I'll pop them over here so I don't lose them. <laughs> and there's a zippy thing here. As well, it's into the pocket. It's a great idea for putting um, photographs in. Um, letters. All sorts are just some place to keep, keep your bits when you're working. This one, again, will go in the junk journal. But I've got a blue one with a yellow zip because I put the grey one in there. Um, and I thought we could maybe do a different take. So that one's at the top. And they're all exactly, it's exactly the same. It's got, do you like it? Zips are fabulous. It's, I mean, you can do them so they're fastened in. You don't actually have to have them so they work. Hi, Gemma. Hi, Helen. Hi Julie. Hi de hi. If you would like to share the live for us, that would be fabulous. Because like I say, Facebook is not played and it's made us go sideways and everything. So you can do this with the zips. You can have them at the top. Um you can even just have the zip for show. So it doesn't actually have to be anything particular. So I've got a bit of this is out of kit two as well, flower tastic. And again, all on the website. I'm gonna so I'm not even doing it by eye. I'm not even going to look. I'm just folding it in. I've trimmed the excess off and I've just folded it in. And then what I'm thinking is, because it doesn't have to be interactive. It doesn't actually have to do anything. It can just be for show. Sure. And then you could have a pocket behind it. So what I'm thinking is, if we maybe stay like this. We're going to have the zip open. Take some of that off. 
and it's going to be a yellow zip so i'm going to find some yellowy colored paper to go on the background of this you just bear with me a second like grab some of course half organized as always where is it um oh that's not it emma where did you put it okay i think we can go pink why not because I don't know where I've put it. Hi, Caroline. Light and shade. Thank you very much. So all I've done is tore it. I'm going to grab this. And it's going to be fastened halfway down. So I don't need all of it. So I'm thinking about there. And then... We'll go to about there. And this is how I measure everything. Use a tape, use a ruler if you want to. You obviously don't have to. The craft police won't come. Do whatever you like. <laughs> whatever makes you feel comfortable. Has everybody had a nice start to the week? I've had a lovely start to the week. Fabulous. I had stuff delivered that was supposed to come and it came on time. And it was correct and it's the right paper and that was all fabulous <laughs> and you've had it yes i've seen your journal so i'm going to ink around the edges hi kelly and i'm going to glue this into the back here I'm not going to glue it right into the back though. I kind of want to glue it to this. So I'm going to hang on until I've got the zip in. Actually, that's a better idea. Now the zip, it is yellow. You could dye it if you want. And it's completely up to you. And I am, it's not going to be... Um, a working zip like the other two that I've done. And I have done this before on a live, so you can easily go back. I can't remember if it was YouTube or Facebook, but I have done it before, so you should be able to find it, no problem. Right, so they can go there. I'll say that's about open to there. And I'll glue those two bits in. Where's my glue glue? You've got your pages excellent. So I like to hear. Nice and crafty. Right. So I'm just gluing the paper to the zip. Again, if you want to sew it in, sew it in. The craft police will not come. I might have to hold it for a second to make it. Actually, I'll move it down a bit so that metal bit stay. And move it over just so it fits. It looks a little bit fiddly, but it's not really. I think I just like to make things look hard as soon as the camera's switched on. I'll hold it for a second. Hi, Terry. I bet it feels good, though, getting back to crafting, does it, Helen? I know it's, it always feels like coming home to me when I, when I get my crafty stuff out. Always feel better. Oh, again like that and then what we're going to do is we're just going to sort of bend the zip up and then glue that in now i'm wishing i had ink this bit so i'll do it now it will be a half a half attempt at there we go the rest i can sort of fill in later so again, I'm going to add glue to the zip this time, I think, because I could be sat here all night holding it open. I'll do this end, give it a head start to go tacky. Now, all I'm going to do is take it off. And wouldn't this have been lovely if it was a grey zip? Any little bits that you've got, you can actually add them as a feature by curling it back a little bit. Mm. I can fit in like that and curl it back a little bit. You can always add ink later and it might just add a more organic feel to it. Like this and hold it open. Pin it down. 
It, it does feel like that, doesn't it? Yeah, and what I need to do, Donna's, Donna's my spot partner, and I haven't done it yet, you know. I keep thinking about it, and then my five-second memory kicks in. Right, so I'm going to trim the bottom of this zip off. And you can just use normal scissors to do it. I don't think it does them any harm. It hasn't done mine any harm. That I know of. And then paint it down. And all this is going to get covered in the back. So I'm not too worried about it. I am going to glue along the bottom here to fasten it. Again, you just pop it. If you can get your glue to work, come on. Okay, that glue doesn't want to work. I think we might be out. Let's locate. We'll use this one. This is not my favourite glue, but it'll do. <laughs> I like a white glue. Ah, oh, there we go. At least it's coming out of here anyway, so we're winning. There we go. And then stick it down. And that will hold the zip fastened as well at the bottom. Excellent. I love, love, love the ATC swap. I think just having that little bit of gets the mojo going doesn't it as well. Right so we've now glued the bottom and we've glued the zip in and that could actually be a pocket. What we could do is just glue down the sides of this and make it so that's the front of it which I think that's what we will do and we will have a pocket behind. So adding glue to the sides and then I'm just going to slide it in and obviously it doesn't matter about the glue touching because it's going to stick down anyway to the front and I think I'll move it down just a smidge and there we go and then coming out of your pocket you can have whatever you want you can have flowers but can have butterflies this is kit two um flower tastic um and while it's still wet the glue you can sort of stick things in and have them peeping out a little bit i've got some flowers and things already colored because i'm hoping we can do some other bits as well see we could even we could go with the yellow couldn't we could pop that in there like that and then have, that's what we'll do so this here again you get um obviously on emma's happy place website this honestly it's so effective what you can do with zips and make them interactive and like i say if you've just got some cheesecloth or something just to sort of glue it to the back of the paper it makes it even tougher in well infinite possibilities with everything i'm thinking i'm not gonna have that one there this is really pretty just as it is isn't it i don't think it needs much more but i've got a big tag that we can put in and then we'll pop it in the journal and then you've got the back side of it as well to decorate in whatever way you want to. I don't think it needs much more, you know, I quite like that. I can't take the credit, I did see somebody else doing it. But uh, this bit kind of fell out my head. So I'll, I'll take credit for this bit. <laughs> Do you know what it is? We get inspiration from everywhere. Absolutely everywhere. And you make it your own and you do your take on it. And I love colours. I do. Sheila, you know how much I love the colours. So I want to have a dream big there. And I think, you know, I'm going to leave that as it is. I will bring this one back in. Because... Do you know when we left the envelopes on Sunday? We'll pop the envelopes in and then we'll have these and I said they were sticky. I'm going to use this to attach this in. 
I am going to add more glue because I see it has had a bath and tea. And then that will fit in nicely into the journal. It's a pocket and I have already got a tag here. Like I'm prepared. So that fits in behind there. But like I say, you can't actually have the zip at the top. And all I've done for the top is fold the zip over and glue the two sides. But I did fold the paper over at the top here, like tucked it inside just to tidy it up a bit and then use a little bit um ribbon. But in the back we made this big pocket, didn't so that could fit into there. Take that out. This one could fit into the back there and hold all your tickets and things of days out that you've had. And we've got this one which holds the tag and then going back to this one which you're gonna to have to pretend you didn't see you're not seeing this at all this one here when you're working in the gym that's a perfect pocket for your infirmary and things like that but can I just say can we just appreciate how nice that paper looks honestly I feel like I've outdone myself <laughs> arguing <laughs> So what I'm thinking is we can, when I have located it, we can decorate this tag as well to match this because it didn't take too long with the zippy thing. Like I say there's really not much to it. Let's clear some space. So I'm thinking this and let's get the colours out as well. I'm going to go with watercolours. very pretty it's very nice paper i do have to say it's it made us very excited when it arrived and it was the right store and yes <laughs> I, I, you, I will hear us nag about this an awful lot so i'm going to go in with magenta all over the place just slap it on nice and easy And then I think I'm going to come in with a teal and we'll see what happens with that. And just in around the bottom. Just around the bottom of the petals. I mean, you can do each petal a different colour if you wanted to. It's completely up to you. At the end of the day, it's whatever you want it to be because it's yours. Oh, Thursday on YouTube, don't forget I'm giving this plaque away and I'm going to do a full flip through of the new collection because I am going to pop it on on Friday and then I'll get them sent off Saturday morning, whoever wants it fast. Because I have got a few, a few surprises up my sleeve. I do, I do. <laughs> and I'm excited, totally excited. I like this. I like this teal. And this uh, watercolour that I've got here was a handmade watercolour. I'm sure it's this one. And I got it off Etsy, just a random... I saw them and thought, oh, and it smells like clove oil, which is not the most pleasant. But they work really well. I, I can't remember what site on Etsy, though. I wish I will have a look, see if I can. But I've had it a while. And the only reason I know that's where it come from is because of the clove oil smell. Quiet, Krista. Is that our Krista there? I was going to say, Krista, you'll not know it's, it's not me quiet. I can talk underwater. <laughs> Krista uh, used to be my next door neighbour, so she knows just how much I can talk. <laughs> Waffle, waffle. I've missed a bit here. In fact, Krista, send us a message. When are you free? <laughs> I could do with some freedom. There we go. Just going to blend it in a little bit. Pull the colours out. Just so they all blend together. 
just like this. And Christy, did you ever start the resin? I bet she's gone now. Her kids will have shouted at her and she'll have vanished. And there we go. Nearly there. Again, it doesn't have to take ages to look good. I think when you think about it less, good things happen, like, it doesn't, you don't overthink it and it just goes on. Ah. I couldn't figure it out. <laughs> Saturday is a date. Reminders on. There we go. And a little hints of yellow in places, just because we can. And it's Emma flower, so it can be whatever you want. Oh no! That you can watch back, it'll be there forever. And I am gonna pop it on YouTube as well. So it will be there forever and ever. And I will give you a sneak peek of the pockets again. There we go, I like that. I'm gonna go in with some green for the leaves. It's a very rainbow flower now, isn't it? I love it. And then we'll dry it off. Hi, Dad! <laughs> I'm getting everybody in tonight. I've got Krista, I've got me dad. Terry's here as well. Oh, Terry, how's your holiday? Are you home? There we go. And what I want to do is I want to grab a white pen and add in all the little details. Just as always. Just adding little flashes of white just to pretend that's where the light comes from and And little lines all the way around. It breaks all the petals up as well. And then you can even go in with a pencil if you want and add even more shading around it. But again, you don't have to because it's completely yours. You can do whatever you want. I do have to say this next collection, though, that's coming out Friday now because it's here. I was slightly concerned it wouldn't be. And the shrink plastic has come. So I'm going to show it all on Thursday. Um, it's all colour you don't have to colour anything in it if you don't want to however i have left um space so you can add your own to make it your own you can add your own little spin on it and things and i will show you it all on thursday at 8 p.m on youtube and i am beyond excited i'll be braced it's driving anybody else up the wall clacking on your desk take them off Oh, Terry, I can only imagine seeing your photographs and the volcano. I mean, how incredible was that? Have you ever seen the been up the volcano before like that? Honestly, if you're friends with Terry on Facebook, have a look at the volcano that she went. I mean, there's so much to see. I, and Tenerife, Tenerife's a volcano, basically, which you probably know. And I, I really didn't fancy going up. Too scared. Oh, and a few little flashes and if I want any more I'll come back and add them in a little while but I'm thinking that there and then I do have all these flowers that I've already coloured in and this one is um, some of the back and paper you know the black and white back and papers um, I've just cut them out so you get loads and loads of different flowers just from that one back and paper that you can fussy cut out and use I think I might chop the stem of this one and add that one in because all the colours work perfect. I'll have that one in and I might have that one there as well and then we can easily chop the leaves off the flowers because again you don't have to use them as a whole. Just because I've drawn them like that and I've given you them like that you don't have to use them like that at all. It's completely up to you however you want to use them. around the edges 
think I'm going to end up cutting these leaves off as well, but that's fine. I'll use them. Wow. Was it hot? Like, did, could you feel the heat being three feet away from it? Obviously, I know lava's hot. My dad will be laughing right now. Oh, God, there's Michael as well. My life. Everybody's here. <laughs> Hello, Michael, from me. Uh, there we go. I'm keeping those leaves so I might add them in. I'm just going to ink them off. And I'm going to use the black as a background. I'm going to add some white before I stick these flowers down. And then I will add some white to these flowers. Oh, look how sad that sponge is all falling to bits. Where's me other thing? Here it is. Again, these are on the website as well. The big and the little ditty ones. If you want to go and have a look at all. Or you can just wait till Friday. You know, with the new goodies. The new toys. New toys. That's better, isn't it? Let's go over them again. Even your scissors match this one. And colour coordinate it all over. Yes, sponges are on the website. They're so handy. To be honest, I haven't found these ones for the bits. I have ruined so many sponges. Just, and I still haven't managed. And I've used it quite a lot. Oh, we need these as well. Just going to tear that off because we're going to add those in. And I will just cover this bit with the flower on. So, move them over. And then ones. And I've lost my white pen because I've. There it is. What I'm going to do is, because we've got the um, zips and things, I'm thinking we'll have some four stitching going on before we add the flowers. And then it'll look like it's behind the flowers. And you can even do it over the flowers if you want to. And this can be done in metallic, so see if you want the stitching in metallic gold. Again, if you anything like our Kelly, she'll just get the sewing machine out. Me, my sewing machine, I got off my mum, and I'm terrified of breaking it, even though she did give us it to use on whatever I wanted. I'm still terrified. So, <laughs> it's all singing, all dancing, it does a gazillion different stitches, and I'm terrified to use it in case I break it. How sad's that? Honestly. I'm just not even a scary woman. <laughs> so do you have a crafty week planned mm, it's going to pop that there and then i'm going to build up the flowers over the top i think i'm going to keep them i'll chop any petals that fall over the top off and then It'll fit inside the pocket. That's that one there. And then this one, you know, I could have left the stem on it. Actually, we'll put it there. And then stick a couple of the green leaves in. Oh, I like these heart-shaped leaves. Is there actually a plant out there with heart-shaped leaves? Or have I just completely made this up? Because like I say, I am that crazy person that walks around where I live. And I'm in people's gardens taking pictures and things. I mean, most of them know us now. Excellent. You will not get distracted. I want to see what you're doing. I want to see all your makes. So they. <laughs> Maureen, what's that? Oh, I'll, I'll find out, I'm sure. And I'm going to have these leaves off as well because I coloured them in and I'm going to use them. You'll put them on. Good, Sheila. Good, good. I'll, I'll be inspectigating. Watching. And if they don't appear, I'll say she's being distracted. She's being distracted. I was going to say I'll message you and tell you off, but I won't because, well, I just won't. <laughs> 
there's that. I think we need a hole punch. Oh. Oh, avalanche. First avalanche of the day. Oh, I've locked my thingy off there. So I'm thinking that may be oh, not far off the middle actually, it's quite good. And we need some a ribbon. Do I have that blue ribbon so it all matches in? Nice. Sorry, I'm just looking for the ribbon that I had like five seconds ago. I'll use this one actually, it's pink. It'll do. Just chop a bit of this off. <laughs> that and reach it. <laughs> yeah, the pink matches, doesn't it? Uh, honestly, the colours, a lot of the time I add a black background just to make the colours pop. And it makes a massive difference. Huge difference. But what I want to do on this is I do have the, the round bottom pins and I think they're called bulb pins. I think that's what I've gathered the cord. And I'm going to add a little tassel on because all these little tassels and things which I seem to be obsessed with. Um, they kind of make a project and all you need to do is you buy um, like little spacer beads or the little pearl beads and things and you just add them on and they don't have to make any sense or anything. They like this one, it's just pink heart balloons and I think it'll look very pretty on here. And in fact we'll add I'm looking for a little silver bead. Oh, I keep little silver beads like this. Um, you can buy them on Amazon. I might try and get some with the pins. I might even do them as kits or I can even maybe make some up and pop them in with makes and orders. I do have, um, if you order over £20 on the website, I do have some little pens I'm giving away as well. So, and they're just really cute, to be honest. And that can sit in there. So I've got the yellow and the pink. And I can add words to it when I decide exactly what's going to go in the journal. Regarding pictures and things like that. But that, with a zip. And you've got this one at the back, with a zip again, which you can add a little tassel to. So that one's at the top. And then, back to the sneaky peek. You've got one here. As well. I think they're called bulb pins, round bottom pins. I can I can pop a link up in the group for what they are. But oh oh don't look, don't look. You can't see it on Thursday. <laughs> yes. But actually now that now that we're already here, I'll just pop that one there as well. But yes. Thank you very much for keeping me company. Don't look. <laughs> you can't see. <laughs> I'm far too excited about this, honestly. It's like, I've had good feedback. <laughs> we see nothing good. I will see you on Thursday on YouTube. Look out for sneak peeks because they will be starting as of now because we've moved it all forward because I'm excited. They'll be on the website forever and get, like, there's no panic. Um, come on Thursday. I will show you more. Um, I will be playing with everything a lot. It matches the first two collections and the shrink plastics will be here and they are coloured as well so you don't even have to colour them in they just have the fun um i won't show you anything else i'll not show you anything else i'll be good but i will see you thursday on youtube at 8 p.m and the kids will be on from friday morning i would say have a lovely lovely week i've enjoyed our little bit crafting tonight and yes get your makes in emma's happy place i want to see everything that you're up to and i'll find these bulb pins the link and i'll just pop it up in emma's happy place the group if you're not a member go and have a look it's lovely in there if you're anywhere else and you've commented on the live i can't actually see the comments and um, i will try and have a look though but sometimes facebook hides them hi dorothy but messages just send us a message if you've asked anything and i haven't seen it i don't mean to be ignorant facebook just hates us so i've decided but have a lovely week and I will see you all Thursday. Bye.